Okay, welcome back to another version of how to measure. Often we are asked if we can run multiple microscribes on the same computer and get data out of each microscribe individually. So this video is going to cover how to obtain that data from two different microscribes onto the same PC. I have on my fixture plate a microscribe MX6 off and I've got a Microscribe G2LX 6 off. So both of these units are plugged into the same PC and we're going to hook them up. So let's get started. In the, uh, the page that you found this video, you will find a download for a folder called MS Probe Manager. And in this folder, you're going to find a couple other folders, whether you want to run the instance in 32-bit windows or 64-bit windows. Um, but it is important that we have two different directories for each, or we have a directory for each microscribe. So I'm just going to take this particular folder and I'm going to copy it and put it right on the desktop again so that we have two folders. So let's go ahead and set it up. I'm going to go into the first folder. I'm going to run a 64-bit instance and I'm going to go ahead and run the executable. All right, so we get a dialog box here, and inside of the dialog box, inches or millimeters, what do we want to run? We've got a connect button, but specifically, we've got this function call, which will enable me to tell it which microscribe I want to run to. So for this instance, I want to connect up to my MX microscribe. I know that its serial number is 90003. So I'm going to go ahead and hit connect and it'll force the connection. Now notice it saw that particular serial number gives me the driver, gives me the ability to uh, compensate for tip length offset and axial deviation. And if I, let's close this window behind us and pull this guy over, you'll notice that if I move the M series microscribe, we're now getting encodings out of that particular instrument. If we hit the button, you can see we get button checks. So we'll leave that one running. Let's pull it down a little bit and let's run the second instance. I'm going to go straight for 64-bit because this is a 64-bit computer. We'll go ahead and start up the instance. Let's uh, close the window behind it. This time I'm going to force it to run serial number 63340. which is the microscribe G2X, G2LX I've got on the table. So you'll notice it went ahead and connected up. G2LX gave us the serial number. Again, gives us the ability to do the tip compensation. And uh, if we pull it over here to the side now, you'll see that if I rotate this particular unit, then we see that encoded rotation. So now we have both microscribes running in the same environment at the same time you can see i'm messing with the mx now we'll shift over here and mix with the g2x so that's how you get individual information and you can run up to oh there's a host of microscribes that you can run i think it's like in the 20s that you can run together really your limitation is going to be usb capabilities um, on your pc and for that matter the usb capabilities on the bus are 252 units so uh, anyways, if you have more questions about this or if we can be of more help, please contact us 434-946-9125 and, uh, or you can email us at support at gomeasure3d.com.